Hey guys, it's me, Chagor Revenge Landscaper, and I started landscaping a few years ago, almost five, and I've had many landscapes, and today I'll show you my collection of landscapes. Let's do this. So I have almost all of my landscapes here, but I don't have the two first ones. So the first one was a razor called Street that I bought. So um, these case I gave me, I gave them to uh, a friend of mine who introduced me to landscaping because I bought them in the wrong size. <laughs> yeah, I'm very smart. Um, so yeah, after these I bought some Oxalo skates, some um, fitness skates uh, with a very strange braking uh, system. Like it's almost like an ABS thing you have on the cars, but you just have to tilt yourself, tilt your feet and something will touch the wheels with, and it will make you slow down. It was a very weird stuff, but kind of... Effective! <laughs> but anyway, these skates were horrible because they make you have bad habits. After these skates, I bought my very first pair of free ride skates. Free ride skates. The Seba FRX. Ta da! Look, 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 look. So these were amazing skates. I'm really glad uh, I've had these skates because I, I've learned a lot of things with them. And they even helped me improve very fast. So these have the, an old version of the X series frames. <laughs> um, yeah, so, so I, I, nowadays I only use them for spare parts. As you can see, there's some stuff missing, like the micro ratchet buckle. Um, I have overlaces, don't have the wheels anymore. Uh, the over one, I don't even have any laces in it. Only use for uh, use them for spare, spare parts. Oh my god! I even pas à là. Je je bug trop. It's very cool here. Um, after these, I think I bought some aggressive skates because I sold my, the over one I had. So uh, it's very hard for me to find skates in my size. So at that time, I think I uh, I managed to find the um, USD. Perfect. It's a mess here because it's um, the second time I'm trying to make this video because it was uh, a nightmare. <laughs> so these are the skates I've had. So the USD Frankie Morales 2s. So carbon skates, as you can see here in the back. Well, the whole base is made uh, out of carbon. So um, with this, I have uh, some ground control frames. I forgot the name, but it's the Brian Aragon edition. I, I'm, I'm, Feverlight, I, I forgot the name, I'm so sorry. Amazing skates, uh, I think these were the first ones I had with um, a unimold design, so without the, a removing removable uh, liner. Light skates, amazing skates, still love them. I only wish they could make them in size 38 instead of 39. The only downfall I can say about these skates. Overall, amazing skates. After this, I bought my very first uh, pair of freestyle skates, the Seba High Light. Ah, see you. Uh, hey! So, the Seba High Light. One of my favorite pair of skates ever. Um, so, huge improvement compared to the FRX I, I was using before because, yes, um, we don't have a removable frame anymore, a uh, removable liner. So, there's less moving parts, so you have a better um, power transfer, precision, overall performance. Amazing skates, I still love them. But after these, I bought 
the effort once free 10 edition so three times one uh, uh, one ten wheels so if you compare these skates uh, to the uh, FRX it's almost almost the same thing but we have some improvements in the um, micro ratchet here so this one is metal in the FRX is uh, plastic I don't know if it matters to you to me not really uh, we have a um, 35 degree strap which has a, another micro ratchet buckle here so more, uh, more precision uh, with the closer closure the mounting um, points are different uh, these have multiple options I think seven in uh, each part so it enables you to have um, different positions uh, on your skates and also enables you to mount different types of uh, frames as well like regarding the size and stuff uh, after this these skates were amazing I still love them uh, but I don't always use the 310 setup inside uh, I often swap them with um, some uh, four wheel frames after these I think I bought my first ice skates well first and all well, first and only ice skates. The Bauer Vapor X 500. And uh, it's a cover here I have in the bottom. Here. So, uh, nice skates, but I still have to, I still struggle with them because uh, they, they hurt a lot. I don't know why, they still didn't take my foot shape. They, do, they really do hurt. Like, I have terrible uh, lace bite here, even if I have a protection thing here in the front, in the tongue. It's just too hurtful. I don't know why. This is this is the pair of skates that hurt me the most. I still want to use them, but <laughs> they, are, they really hurt a lot. After this, I bought my very first pair of carbon freestyle skates. The Seba Highlight. Carbon. As you can see here in the back. So the whole base is from carbon. And I think these are my favorite pair of skates, period. I've used them a lot. Um, I think most, most of my videos have been shot with these skates. I still use them a lot. And I absolutely love the cuff, the precision of it, the responsiveness I have with um, the carbon. Amazing skates, I totally recommend these. I think after this I bought my, hmm, I bought a pair of my dream skates, the Igors 2K16, and yeah, my dream, these are the skates from uh, my favorite skater of all time, Igor Shiremetyev, and I absolutely love them, I think I, 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 I like them um, as much as the Highlight Carbons. I still have to make them have my foot shape because sometimes they do hurt, especially in this part. But I think it's only a matter of time before it takes a, it fully takes a, my foot shape. So I'm really glad, I, really glad I have these skates because Igor is the one, the person who inspires me the most. So you know, you know what I mean. You know, you know what I mean. So after this. Power Slide sent me a pair of skates for me to do a video. It's the One Wave or Wave One. I'm so sorry. I always mix the, the name. So it's a nice pair of skates for beginners, and it has some cool features like this: the LED. I don't know if you can see it, and uh, a reflective um, frames uh, when you're skating in, uh, in the dark, so cars can see you. So it's a safe pair of skates, and yeah, it was cool to get it with them. I'm really glad to announce you that I have a partnership with Seba Skates. Um, thank you very much for this. Because I'm not only thank you Seba Skates, but all of you. Because it's thanks to you that all of this is happening. So Seba Skates will help me making less skating videos for you guys. So thank you very much for this. My favorite brand helping me my channel. This is just magical. Thank you very much guys. These are my inline skates and I'm wondering what are yours? It doesn't matter if you only have one pair or 100, please tell me in the comment section below your inline skates. 
Guys, tomorrow is my birthday and I'm wondering if I could do my first live video with you guys. Are you up for that? It will be a great opportunity for me to chat with you. And I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to subscribe and please help me make it more popular by sharing this video to your friends. You can change everything. Think about it. Alright guys, see you in the next episode.